In the nearly 10 months since the Peace Health University District Hospital closed, Eugene residents say seeking health care has proven to be a challenge. KEZI 9 News reporter Joey Vaca shows us what people in Eugene are now doing in response. We're close to one year since Eugene's only hospital closed its doors. And for the past year, residents have had a hard time adjusting. Jensina Hawkins lives in Eugene and says her neighborhood has become like a health care desert. She says she grew up in Reed Sport and remembers needing the drive to Eugene for any serious health care needs. Now to be living in Eugene and feeling like we still have to go somewhere else. Right now, of course, we do have a hospital in Springfield, but then there's always the concern of if any sort of a natural disaster happens, takes out the bridges, then all of us on this side of the river are kind of stranded. So this week, Hawkins and Churchill area neighbors are hosting a health care forum open to anyone to discuss Eugene's shortage issue. The panel of speakers includes state representatives like Nancy Nathanson and Oregon Speaker of the House, Julie Fahey. We want the citizens to feel heard. I want everyone to leave there saying, I feel heard, I feel seen. This is the first time maybe for a lot of folks in this town that it feels like someone actually cares. We know that they do care, but a lot of that work is behind the scenes. On Thursday, Hawkins says she hopes the speakers are able to see just how serious of an issue this is for the community there's power in numbers and so being able to show them this is such a huge deal for their constituencies or for the consumer memberships for their patient panels this is this is more than just a few people who took the time to send in, who took the time to track down an email address for a congressperson the forum is thursday evening at 6 30 at the willamette christian center on 18th avenue in eugene admission is free reporting in eugene joey vaca kzi 9 news